Welcome in everyone. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. It is January 15th. No, sorry, January 16th. And it is Monday, and we have another FIFA 23 6 p.m. content video today. Let's jump into Ultimate Team um, and see what we got here on Monday. We normally get upgrade packs, but I'm not really sure what else we'll get aside from that because the, the what was it yesterday? We got the World Cup hero and the base hero player pick um in the sbcs so well you know what let's just go check out sbcs what kind of player did we get a player did we get a player um alex fernandez was oh stefan radu so alex fernandez was a player from uh over the weekend i think it was yesterday if i remember and then stefan radu romanian that plays for who is this for Latium, who's Latium? Is it Lazio? It's Lazio. It's Lazio. He's center back, 82 pace, uh, 69 shooting, 75 uh, passing, 79 dribbling, 88 defending, and 83 physicality. Three star, three star, medium high work rates. He's got he's a left footed center back as well. Plays in the Serie A. A lot of Serie A players here in Centurions. I just realized that from Team One and Team Two. Um, his acceleration to 78, sprint speed is 85, defensive awareness is 90, that's actually really good. Stamina 78, aggression 90, um, his traits are giant throw in, one club player, that's kind of cool. Solid player, early crosser, and a leadership and injury prone. Uh, he's one segment and you have six days to complete him. Let's see what you gotta do. It's an 85 and higher overall players, minimum two and an 83 rated squad and you get well, what, what is his rating an 87 in return so that's not too bad an 83 rated squad but you do submit in two 85s and i think 85s are pretty expensive right now because of the the base or world cup hero hero player pick right now that sbc that's going on so they could be a little bit expensive but i mean you're getting an 87 rated player back in return that you can use in other sbcs further down the road uh, did we get anything else though? Let's check the live tab. Did we get anything else in here? Um, this is the one that I was talking about by the way 87 plus base or FIFA World Cup hero player pick uh, 80 plus upgrade packs. These are for the objective that's going on Centurion's challenge Four. okay a prime election players pack tradable and you have two days to complete this and it asks for players from the same league maximum five players from the same country minimum two players from one club maximum five rare players minimum one overall rating is a 75 and the total chemistry is a 23 and um yeah you get a prime election players pack in return which is tradable which is kind of good but did we not oh there it is i was just about to say man did we not get anything as an upgrade packs but we did an 82 plus upgrade earn a pack containing a rare gold player rated 82 or higher uh three days to complete this it's obviously repeatable and for this you just need player quality minimum gold rare players minimum four and number of players in their squad is seven so four rare players and then the rest are gold commons so three gold commons that's not bad and it's seven players that's really good i'm gonna favor that i'm gonna try to craft as many as i can for team of the year because apparently team of the year is coming out this friday and i really really want to pack a team of the year there was nothing else there in sbc's on two objectives i don't think we have anything going on other than the centurions cup which i've totally forgot about i literally forgot about that um doesn't look like it how about milestones centuries of wins this is new um win 10 matches in squad battles or rivals wait is this new i don't know if this is new no wait maybe it is what is this century on matches oh this one is new okay so you win 10 matches in squad battles yeah 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 this is new okay I'm, I'm looking at it and I see that I already have four of whatever. Wait, I don't know if this is new. I could totally be wrong. My bad, guys. I don't know if this is new or not. Honestly, I don't remember seeing this at all on Sunday. Um, yeah, this could be new. It could not be new. But either way, win, win matches in squad battles or rivals, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. And the overall reward is a premium gold players pack. What the heck? For winning 90, you get an ultimate pack, and then winning 100, you get 584 plus player pack. 
what the heck? <laughs> anyways, uh, they're all untra untradeable. Anyways, they're all untradeable. Silver Cup. I haven't really played Silver Cup at all this year. Uh, EA Sports Cup. What is this? Uh, your cheer on your favorite teams for an FGS swap token. Okay, so this is an FGS swap token. Interesting. No other leagues here for squad foundations. And how about how about this? No thing, nothing, nothing, nothing in an event. <laughs> nothing in an event. All right, YouTube, that's going to be the end of this video. Not a lot of content other than the new player, the Romanian player that plays for Lazio, the center back. I already forgot his name. Sorry. Uh, Radu, something, something Radu. Um, there was no new icons. There was the upgrade packs, the 82 plus upgrade packs. There he is, Radu, right there on my screen. Um, we got that Centurion's Challenge uh, uh, SBC as well. And in objectives, I don't know if that objective was new or not, where you have to win matches in squad battles or rivals, but it is there. Uh, also, that swaps token for FGS, watching FGS, which I don't know how to claim, because I've actually tried doing it when it first came out earlier this year, and it just didn't work for me. Um, I'm assuming you go to Twitch or something, you watch there, you watch the EA channel, right? The EA Sports channel. And then there was nothing in moments, and I checked also the store, and there was nothing new in the store. Um, but yeah, like I said, that's pretty much the end of this video. Hope you guys did enjoy the content today. If you guys did like the content, go ahead and give the video a like. And if you guys did not like the content, well, go ahead and give the video a like anyways. And if you're new to the channel, please sub to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Laters.